Why do some people buy grocery at a gas station? Let's talk about opportunity cost. Let's talk about how much is worth your free time. So how do you calculate this? So let's say from the next town to over here, it takes you one hour and 10 minutes to walk. How much would you pay for taxi to save you one hour? Keep in mind it takes taxi 10 minutes to drive from over there to over here. So how much would you pay? Is it $10, $20, $100 or in dinners, with wherever you watch? So that's how you calculate how much is your free time worth. And so you go to gas station, right? And you tank the car. And while you're already there, you grab a bag of chips. But you know that in the grocery store, it costs less than here in the gas station. So you decide you're not gonna buy here. You're gonna drive all the way to the grocery store on the other side of the town. You're gonna buy that bag of chips and then you're gonna walk home. Then you're gonna drive home. So first of all, you lost money on the gas. You lost money on your time just to save a few cents. Like, and th those are small things people do. But what I did is, so in December, I decided I want to buy some equipment, you know, like a microphone or camera and tripod and stuff like that. And I found it on the internet and I'm like, you know what, I'm not going to pay for shipping and handling because I'm cheap or I want to save money or whatever you want to uh, say. But I'm like, I'm not going to pay for that. I'm just going to go to the store and I'm going to buy. And I went to a store and they said they don't have it. I have to go to like a bigger store in another city. So I couldn't do it over there. But I don't go to another city, to a bigger city that, that often. And that's a problem because now I have to spend money to go to that city. It takes me time to go over there. It takes me at least an hour. Then I have to like use the public transportation go to the store, buy things, and do the same thing back. And yes, it's gonna be a little bit cheaper, and I'm ensuring that I get the highest quality, that the product's not gonna get like banged or scratched or anything, and that I would have like insurance on it and everything else, but it takes my time. I decided that in end of November, beginning of December, now it's beginning of February and I did, didn't buy any of those stuff. Why? Because I was always postponing that like, I'm too busy now, I'm too lazy now, it's raining, I don't have money or whatever. And I managed to find an excuse to not buy those stuff. And let me tell you something, I lost so much in those two months. Like, I was planning on creating some stuff and I require a higher quality equipment than my phone over here. My phone over here is perfect. For now, for like the beginning, well, I need to upgrade because, you know, like people deserve higher quality than me just standing over here in bad lighting with bad phone and like, this is all I have, like this frame is all I have right now. So like, if I want to adjust, it blocks the camera. If I want to move over here, well, I can't unless I carry it. Like if I want to bring stuff over here, then I don't see what you see because I'm blocking the camera. Like, and it's just not professional, you know? And I want to make it professional. And that's why I want to have the better equipment. But because I didn't want to pay for shipping handling, I'm two months late on my plans. You know what? Like, fuck the high quality or whatever. I'm two months late on my plan, so I had a plan. Like, I had all like written down and systemized and this and that and all everything. And I'm late because like I have other things to do that prevent me for like, um, how do I say? They prevent me for like having a one day off and 
go to another town and buy stuff like that because like I want to rationalize the money I spend and then like oh if I go to another city I'm not gonna be there for like a half an hour I'm gonna see my friends my family or this and that and everything I'm like gonna spend the whole day over there and then I'm not gonna just gonna buy like a microphone it's not just worth for me to go to another city to buy a microphone then I'm like well I'm gonna buy everything and I'm like well I don't have every money for everything right now I'm gonna have later but not right now so I'm like okay then I'm gonna wait till I have enough money till I save enough money and then I'm gonna buy everything I need and that waiting is costing me like not financially costing me but I'm like I'm late on my plans and I have to push everything back and then I have other responsibilities I'm gonna go to USA soon and that if I don't do it right now I have to postpone everything else to like till I come back and that's a problem so that's why you should not do that and hope this video is like helpful to you and that you're not gonna waste the opportunity like invest some money and Make sure it gets delivered to you so you don't have to run around and so forth. Okay, bye bye.